Hello and welcome. In this video we show you how to give life to your PowerPoint charts. Rather than presenting all results at once, let's give ourselves the opportunity to tell a story. We have a much better chance of retaining our audience's attention if we develop our case slowly. As each new set of information appears, we can, for example, comment on what was good, what went wrong, and so on. By doing so, the final picture will make more sense and hopefully participants will retain key points more easily. Chart animation may look complicated, but between us, only a few mouse clicks are needed. Here is how. To benefit from PowerPoint's extensive chart animation features, we do not copy and paste an existing chart from Excel. That wouldn't work. Instead, we select a predefined chart slide and by double-clicking on its icon, launch the chart add-in, which, by the way, is just about the same as Excel's. In the datasheet, we either enter the new numbers manually or we copy and paste them from Excel. It works best if you delete all existing data first, position the cursor in the empty cell just above A1 and execute paste. Once the chart layout is to our liking, we execute the custom animation command in the slideshow menu and select our favorite animation options. Then we go into the effect options to fine tune the animation. By default, the entire chart will appear as one single object, but we may select other options in the drop down list. For pie charts, the only other choice is by category, so let's take that. And here we are. When we launch the chart slide in presentation mode, each mouse click will bring forward a new piece of information. Now that you have seen how easy it is to animate chart elements, don't hesitate to use this feature. By doing so, you breathe new life into your presentations.